Here's why we want you to stop smoking and taking cocaine and taking any form of nicotine, anything that squeezes blood vessels down before your surgery. Normally, blood vessels are, say, this big and lots of blood can flow. And the blood contains red blood cells and those red blood cells hold onto oxygen and deliver it to the tissues. When you put a patch on that contains nicotine or chew nicotine gum or take cigarette, uh, smoke a cigarette or even breathe in someone's cigarette smoke, what happens is those blood vessels go way down and so many fewer blood cells can flow. Now, when we do a lot of the procedures we do in plastic surgery, we're cutting tissue and we're lifting it up. And so we're cutting through blood vessels. So the way that the skin survives is you've got blood flowing through one part. So that could be a facelift, it could be a breast lift or breast reduction or tummy tuck. And we're relying on that restricted blood flow to deliver oxygen and allow the tissues to survive and heal. So if you take one cigarette after surgery or right before surgery, your blood vessels squeeze way down and what can happen? You might have a dead nipple if you had a breast lift or an open wound of your cheek. It's just not worth it. And you want your, your wounds to heal. So that's why we ask you to please stop smoking and your doctor will tell you if it's four weeks or six weeks, it really depends on the risk during the procedure.